if you need to see a certain net in your layout, maybe as part of a LVS debug, or to see where it is physically located in your design. One way to do this is with RVE after an LVS run. I'll show how to do that in this video. I'm using Design Rev, but this works equally well with other viewers. I'm running an LVS job and I'm watching for the Caliber RVE application to come up. Here in RVE, I'll use the Finder capability. I'll enter VREF for the object name. That's the name of the net I'm interested in. I'll click Find. And a uh, clickable icon appears of the object I'm interested in. Now before I click that icon to highlight, I'm going to clean up my windows. I'm going to uh, hide with a shift hide all of the layers I'm currently looking at. I'm going to touch the number 9 to expand all of my uh, viewing levels. And then I'll click that icon to highlight the data. The highlight shows up in several areas. My layout editor, I can zoom into that. It also shows up in the uh, schematics. Uh, generated within uh, LVS RVE. I'll close those uh, schematics since I'm really only interested in the layout viewer right now. And I'll expand uh, this panel so that I can uh, see some more information about these net layers, some detailed information. In fact, I could selectively highlight just Metal 3, Metal 2, Metal 1. So that's one way to highlight a net by name using the finder capability in RVE after LVS. This is Chris Balcom with Caliber Customer Support. If you like this video or you have an idea for maybe a related video, let us know in the comments here on YouTube. Thanks.